Now, if I go to build and then furniture and bed, um, you notice that this box comes up here. It's a little bit different. Um, this is due to the most up-to-date DF hack. And now if I hit the arrows here, um, then I can go back to close, uh, use closest material and keep building after, after placement. So now we have it on this right here. Now we have, I can place the beds as planning mode here. You see the P next to it. Um, so planning mode is back into DF hack, which is great. These ones here, they're kind of just placeholders for beds. So if I make four more beds, one, two, three, four, they'll just, instead of bringing it to the stockpile, they'll, they'll then place it in these positions here. It's pretty nice. Something that we used to do in version 47, I'm glad it's back. Now what's cool about this planning mode is that I can put a filter in. I haven't done it in this version yet. I haven't played with this tool yet. Because I just installed it. But I should be able to put a filter in like that. And then say... Stone only. Or un clear that filter and then come down here and just like... Or maybe even search. Obsidian only. So now only obsidian any chair of obsidian, the quality doesn't make a difference. Or I could disable the qual the uh, material filter and then put a quality filter in uh, down here. So exceptional or exceptional to artifact. So this is, this is gonna prevent us from, oh, I can move the window around too. This is gonna prevent us from building artifacts by accident which is kind of cool, but I really like the planning mode and I've always liked the planning mode even from version 47 here and beyond. So that's great that the planning mode is back. Thanks for checking out this short clip from my Dwarf Fortress Let's Play. Hit the thumbs up and let me know what you think in the comments. Make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss any videos. If you want to see the full series, go to the playlist section of my YouTube page.